Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my afternoon news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Take a look at this photo right here. Commission takes look at possible changes to bail reform law. Critics say law allows dangerous offenders to be released. After complaints from some police departments about dangerous and repeat offenders being released on bail, New Hampshire lawmakers are going back to work again on the state's bail reform law. Unlike a year ago when bail reform was a consensuous issue, there are now deep political divisions. When the first bail reform commission met last year after the controversial law passed, Police said it felt like no one wanted to listen to their concerns about dangerous and repeat offenders being released. With a second commission now getting underway to address some of the problems, law enforcement predicted. Police officials said they're hopeful some kind of change. That was very interesting that those that have been speaking out saying there's nothing wrong with bail reform are now the same exact people sitting in here now saying, you know what, something does need to change with bail reform, said Manchester Police Chief Carl Capano. Buzz Shear of the University of New Hampshire School of Law wrote bail reform bill and blasted police criticism of the law. He said he's now open to compromise. I think there are tweaks to be made to the status as it's written in terms of dangerousness in terms of failure to appear, Scheer said. If it turns out to be a significant problem, that will help manage those significant problems. Officials said data is needed to determine the exact of problems, but the court system is unable to provide a comprehensive look at how a new law is actually working or not working statewide. Some still question whether bail reform is even an issue. Are the problems that we're seeing problems that are a result of bail reform or would they be the same issue we would have seen had they done nothing? said Circuit Court Judge David King. Politics of bail reform are involving rapidly. Governor Chris Sununu, a former supporter, slammed the law earlier this week on WMUR's Close Up. It has failed, Sununu said. It has not worked. It needs to be massively overhauled. And any any argument otherwise is just trying to be political. Senate Democrats who champion bail reform contend more training is needed for police and court, but they expect to file legislation to make more changes. Everybody needs to understand the process and that has not happened yet, but we're getting there, said State Senate Milan Levesque, Democrat of Nashua. 
And that does it for my afternoon news report right here on the Riley King Network. Have a great rest of your afternoon, and I'll see you back here later on today for another news report. Goodbye, everyone.